All right, you know, I started working on a 16 gauge project and uh, I got a buddy of mine actually give me this one. It was taped together. It's the same model. Hers is a 107B. This one's actually a 94 um, H. And this one was just the old beat up one he had in his closet that it won't stay locked. So, basically what we're going to do with this one, if you see the problem is right here, when you lock this in, when the ejector is locked in to place, you get this little hook that hooks in here. And I've already reshaped it a little bit, but if you look, see if I can find a straight edge to show you. This thing is actually sitting up higher. That's why it's keeping it from locking. I don't know if you can see that. It's actually bottoming out in the uh, receiver. So we got to straighten that out and or replace it. And I guess we will do uh, two Stevens shotguns at one time. And it was missing various screws. Uh, we are going to have to take this part right here. These are stripped out. We're going to take and um, what I'll actually do is take these are the original the screws that go in it. When you tighten them up, when you tighten them down, there you, you see they'll just slide right in and out. There's nothing to hold them. So probably what we're going to do is we're going to fill these in with a, a wooden dowel and wood glue, and then we'll redrill these these holes. So we will be able to get a tight seal. I'm going to replace a few pieces of hardware as there's various pieces missing. So that's going to be the project for that. We're going to do a 16 and a 12 at the same time, I reckon. So I got to go by the hardware store, pick me up some screws. Got to get reshaping this. Uh, ejector lock and then we'll go from there